What's up everybody? I'm back Monday morning right here at the uh, office depot. I got to uh, send out a couple stuff. I got to send out some stuff, scan some stuff. So let's get in here. Wow, dude. How you doing? Good, how you doing? Good. Holy fuck me. Wow, so look at this line, man. Like, I'm not sure if I'm trying to, I'm not sure if I'm trying to wait up in here for like an hour, because seriously, bro man got, bro man got things to do. <laughs> is there, is there a... Uh, any other place here in town I can go to just get something like scanned and sent to an email other than right here? Other than here? Yeah. Um, Staples. Staples? Yeah, it's way down off Day Street. Day Street? Yeah. Okay. And then, I'm trying to think, I think there's like a Kinko's FedEx around here too. I just don't know where. I think, it's same in that same, I think it's in that same parking lot. It oh, is be, it? It could be FedEx or the other one. Well, I know it's FedEx because they bought out Kinko's. Oh, okay. So it's a FedEx. It, they call it FedEx Kinko's. Right on. Yeah, but that's, or I don't know if Walgreens or CVS does stuff like that. Okay. I know they do photos okay. and whatnot, but um, yeah, it's Staples down down here too. Off of Day Street. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, because yeah. I don't think I have all that time. Well, I know. Well. A lot of this stuff goes pretty. I mean, some some people you'd be surprised sometimes. Oh, I know. I don't know. Trust me. I'm. So I'll jump in there and I'll be there and I'll be like, all right, ten minutes, and then I'll get like two people, and, and then <laughs> twenty minutes, and then next thing you know, it's forty minutes, and it's like, well, fuck. Well, that's like this is uh, our copy center is the fifth busiest in the nation oh, yeah? in the company. Wow. Yeah. This one right this, here. This is the fifth busiest one wow. with the number of transactions we do. Yeah. Yeah. It's it tops up in the top five. Wow. That's why, and you know, a lot of times, yeah, it's like one, two things, but uh -huh. sometimes, yeah, it's just depending what time of day and what it is. All right. All so, right. yeah, man. Right. So. Too bad we can't make appointments. Now that <laughs> that would be awesome, right? Yeah. Then, then basically, we'll, we'll if have, it's the busiest one. Yeah. I mean, yeah, why not, be, right? Yeah. Yeah. True. True. You know. So. But I know with with a lot of that, it's yeah, we're gonna still have a line. Yeah. And we're gonna have appointment after appointment. Well, everything, it will be organized chaos. Right. <laughs> All, right, All right, thanks, brother. You're All right, so, get on up out of here. I'm going to try this other spot down the road. It's actually closer to where I'm going anyway. I'm going to Riverside today. I got a meeting with the, with the uh, ch -ch -ch -ch, what's his name again? Business consultant. Yeah, Al Go Harry. So, I'm headed that way anyway. Let me go and check out Staples. I've never been to Staples on that side of town, so let me go check that out. Back here. <laughs>
Oh, you know what? I had a schedule for three. You know what's funny? Because I, I had a schedule for. Well, you had a schedule for three thirty, but I wrote down three o'clock just to make sure I got here on time. No. Okay, good. <laughs> you filming? I'm vlogging. Oh, you're vlogging. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So it turns out that I'm actually 30 minutes early. Um, I wrote it down on my calendar for 3 o'clock, but my meeting's actually for 3.30, so I got some extra time to finish my food and send out a couple emails, so staying on top. <sighs> All right. Mission accomplished. I got a lot of homework to do. A lot of homework to do. Uh, just got some information about some seminars that I'm gonna be attending in the future. Um, I got a lot of homework, not only for myself, but for the team too. Because, you know, this Thursday we're, we're having a board meeting and one of the things we're gonna be uh, detailing is just Defining our roles and what everybody's supposed to be doing. So I still gotta go do one of my side hustles right now. Uh, okay, open, open. <laughs> I'll catch up with you guys in a bit. Alright guys, so I'm here at work and uh I'm about to run inside and eat before I gotta clock in. But before I do, I just want to come on and, and wrap up this vlog here. But before I do, I just want to share with you guys a book that I am reading on a daily basis, Think and Grow Rich by Napoleon Hill. And this is an every, everyday read. And so inside the book, you know, there's uh, every single day you read just a small little paragraph. Just, you know, take a little, a little something, something, you know, and, and, you know, use it, you know, see if it resonates with you. And uh, today, this book here, my read today resonated with me because... Today's uh, talk was about how, you know, if you're doing if you're doing a business or if you're starting it up, you know, if you're walking into the marketplace, make sure that your product or service or your item is something of, of enough value to people. Make sure that it's something that's going to, it's actually going to sell, all right, because if it doesn't, then, you know, it would be wise, if you know, to take a step back and go ahead and replot, and, you know, your plan. Come up with a better game plan or just come up with a better service that you can actually uh, provide for those people who are out there in the marketplace so um, hope you guys found that valuable hope you guys check out this book too it's a really great uh, read it was given to me by a really really good friend of mine and i'm glad he gave it to me because i, I read this every day along with reading other books that i try to read i also read this every day so uh thank you guys for tuning in if you haven't done so please subscribe and uh, happy, happy Monday. Let's keep it grinding. Let's keep it going, guys. I'll talk to you tomorrow. Take care.